A customer complained about the shifting quality on his vehicle. To find the problem, turn on the ignition and connect the vehicle to the diagnosis unit. First perform a quick test. If this test completes without the relevant error, select Transmission Control for 9-speed transmission and click Next. Under Symptoms, press Automatic Transmission. In the following screen, tick Poor Shift Quality and confirm with Next. In the list, first select the History of Repairs. And the last transmission repairs are shown. In our case, the oil level check had already been performed and saved. Click Next to return to the overview. Now you see more closely the overview of shift operations. If there is a customer complaint, confirm with Yes. In the overview, the most striking shift operations are documented. More detailed information about the possible driving situations can be found by clicking the button with the information symbol. Click Next to return to the list. Then carry out a test drive using the test cycle simulator screen. You need two people. Select the process that matches the complaint and start the test drive. Follow the safety instructions. Then set the required operating program. The test drive should take place within the display temperature range of problem shifting. In our case, that means with a warm transmission below 75 degrees Celsius. The bar indicates the value of the accelerator pedal. Keep the accelerator pedal so that the bar stays in the green range. During the test cycle, the problem can also be rectified in some circumstances because the transmission tries to adapt. In our case, the jolt occurs when shifting from second to third gear. So continue to search for the cause. Reselect the faulty shift operation and look at the information. The evaluated adaptations and monitors are still OK. Therefore, click on Possible Solutions. We know that the oil level is OK due to the repairs performed. Therefore, for the next repair, carry out the standstill adaptation. Once the possible solutions have been carried out, return to the overview and display the information for the problem shift operation. Now the overview displays conspicuous values in the adaptations. Under possible solutions, the next steps are displayed. Perform the repair of the respective parts in the workshop. Then document the work. Answer the question with yes. Select the appropriate shift operation and in the questionnaire enter all work carried out. Once everything has been filled in, confirm with yes. The data has been successfully entered into the control unit and now appears in the history. To be on the safe side, carry out another test drive, then the vehicle can be handed over to the customer.